By simply holding back, keeping silent, occasionally uttering ambiguous phrases, deliberately appearing inconsistent, and acting odd in the subtlest of ways, you will emanate an aura of mystery, unquestionably a classic that is excellent and will endure for a long time. In 48 Laws of Power, the laws for gaining power in life, business, and other areas are explained. Each rule is illustrated historically. There are also examples of people who broke the rules. Cynical people may perceive some laws as being manipulative and some of them are. Nevertheless, because they are all based on the truth of human nature, it is more crucial to comprehend them before deciding how, when, and which of them to use than simply be ignorant of them and refuse to acknowledge their existence. Make those above you feel confidently superior at all times. Don't overdo it when showcasing your skills in an attempt to impress or please them. Otherwise, you risk doing the exact opposite and instilling insecurity and fear. You will rise to the pinnacles of power if you can make your masters appear smarter than they are. Outshining the master is perhaps the worst mistake of all. Hire a former enemy and he will be more loyal than a friend. Friends will betray you more quickly because they are more susceptible to envy. They also develop into spoiled and oppressive. However, a former enemy will be more obedient than a friend because he has a greater sense of obligation. In actuality, you have more to worry about friends than enemies. Find a way to create enemies if you don't already have any. Keep people guessing and off balance by never revealing the reason for your actions. They can't prepare a defense if they don't know what you're up to. Guide them far enough down the wrong path, envelop them in enough smoke, and it will be too late by the time they realize your intentions. When trying to impress people with words, the more you say, the more common you appear and the less in control you appear. Even if you're saying something mundane, make it vague, open-ended, and sphinx-like. Powerful people impress and intimidate by saying less. The more you say, the more likely you are to say something stupid. Power is founded on reputation. You can intimidate and win solely on the strength of your reputation, however, once you slip, you are vulnerable and will be attacked from all sides. Make your name untouchable. Always be on the lookout for potential attacks and prevent them from occurring. Meanwhile, learn to destroy your adversaries by destroying their reputations, then step back and let public opinion decide. Utilize the expertise, knowledge, and hard work of others to advance your cause. Not only will such help save you precious time and energy, but it will also endow you with a godlike aura of quickness and efficiency. Ultimately, your helpers will be forgotten while you are remembered. Never do something that someone else can do for you. Lure others into your territory or the territory of your choice. You are in charge when you coerce someone else into taking action. Making your opponent come to you and forego his plans is always preferable. Entice him with fantastic gains, then strike. You are in charge. Any apparent victory gained through argument is a pyrrhic victory. The resentment and ill will you sow are stronger and last longer than any apparent change of opinion. It is far more powerful to persuade others to agree with you through your actions rather than words. Demonstrate, not explicate. You can die from someone else's misery. Emotional states are as contagious as a disease. You may believe you are assisting the drowning man, but you are causing your disaster. Unfortunate people sometimes attract misfortune to themselves. They will also attract misfortune to you. Instead, associate with the fortunate and happy. You must constantly be needed and desired if you want to keep your independence. More reliance on you means more freedom for you. Make people rely on you for their well-being and prosperity and you won't have anything to worry about. Never give them enough knowledge to enable independence. A genuine and honest move will outweigh dozens of dishonest ones. Even the most suspicious people are taken aback by open-hearted acts of honesty and generosity. You can deceive and manipulate them at will once your selective honesty has pierced their armor. It is crucial to be aware of your competition. To stay one step ahead, use spies to collect important information. Ask people ambiguous questions to elicit disclosures about their flaws and motivations. There is never a situation where snooping can't be done skillfully. Having a visible plan and taking on a shape exposes you to attack. Keep adaptable and mobile rather than adopting a form that your adversary can seize. Never bet on stability or long-lasting order. The best defense is to be as fluid and formless as water. Everything is in flux. That's it for this one. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give it a thumbs up and do stick around for more book reviews.